From fitness to swimming in the ocean, the Sun Coast is a very active area, and a Bradenton joint replacement specialist says as a result, hips and knees are wearing out. A Sun Coast man shares his journey of barely being able to walk without a cane to being able to dance at his son's wedding. One year ago, Bruce Labadee felt so much pain in his right hip, he could hardly function. It felt like despair, you know, to me. I didn't think I was going to, I didn't know what was going to happen. I just knew I couldn't live that way. Degeneration of his hip. And at that point, we decided that uh, it was probably time for hip replacement. Dr. Alan Valaday with Coastal Orthopedics tried several non-surgical procedures first, but nothing seemed to help Bruce's pain, so he decided to perform a hip replacement. I actually thought Bruce was a great candidate to do this as an outpatient, which is where we do the same operation we just, that we do in the hospital. We just do it um, as an outpatient. We do it at a surgery center, and he was able to go home the same day as the operation, and he's done fantastic. The surgery started at 8 a.m., and Bruce was home just six hours later. I said, I, I feel great. It's, it's, it's no pain. He wasn't able to just walk, but two weeks later, dance at his son's wedding. And I, and I didn't even use my cane that day. And I mean, I probably should have used it, but I, I didn't need it. I didn't feel like I needed it, so, but I got up and, and, and danced. Dr. Valaday says 2016 saw more than 50% of U.S. citizens having knee and hip replacements less than 65 years old. We're, have, we're seeing a healthier population undergoing these procedures, and again, Bruce was a great candidate for that. I'm, you know, I basically got my life back. 